Hello, Georgia Burns here. Today I'd like to show you how I made this card. I made a version of this um, using my own stash. So I tried to do with the proper dies another version, if you get what I mean. The only thing I'm changing is the colour and the sentiment. Only because I cannot remember where I got this sentiment from. It's not in the stamp set Forever Fern, which I'm using here. So I can't remember where I got this from. So I'm just going to use the word hello from this stamp set. It doesn't make any difference. So, what I'm going to do is change the colour and I'm using Balmy Blue. So I have a Balmy Blue at two and a half inches by three... Oh, three and five eighths by two and five eighths. So it's two and five eighths by three and five eighths. And this is three and a half by two and a half, the white piece. Which will go on top like that. I have a white card base of eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths. I had a white card base. I'll go and get one in a minute. And I have two white pieces of card at five and five eighths by three and seven eighths. One for the inside and one for the top. So let me go and get a card Face. Left it in the drawer. So that's like I said, five and seven eighths by three by eight and a quarter, scored at four and one eighth, folded in half. My two white pieces and my decorative pieces, which will sit on there. Stamp sets I'm using. Crackle paint, but I'm not going to do it as dark. This is crumb cake, and I think it's quite dark. What I'll do is I'll stamp off and forever fern. And we're going to be using that leaf, that one, and that one. I have cut out the two blue leaves and the two side green leaves so we've still got to cut out a green one of them you can't see that, it's too bright a green one of them and the blue and these dark ones so let's get them out of the way, get that out of the way, we don't need them. What we need is a scrap, some scraps to do these leaves. Right, I did the green one in Mossy Meadow, so ink that up and Stamp it down, that in Mossy Meadow, and the other one, the bubble leaf I call it, I did in a darker blue, which I never brought. Night and Navy. Doing very well on this, I'm forgetting stuff. Right, light and navy, and we'll stamp that down. Oh, that's quite dark, but it's nice. We need the light and navy out for the sentiment. I've got a strip of white here. And my hello stamp. isn't very straight it's 
stamp that down. Oh, over stamped, I haven't done that for ages. Stamp that down. It's better. Not very straight. It's better. I don't need a good clean that stamp. What else? Just the background stamp. Oh, let's cut these out. And I've got some light and navy here to cut the plain ones out. So with my Sizzix sidekick and my plates, I should put that on. I've got the die sitting here at the side. I'm waiting for some um, magnetic sheets so I can put them put them in a wallet because they're too big to go in the stamp box. Too many of them. I'll show you in a sec. I haven't even got enough um, magnet sheet to be, keep them in this. So there's loads of them. I've got one, two, three, four out. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen dies. Is that right? Should be fourteen. One, two, oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen dies. And there's just too many of them to go in the lid of my stamp set, so I shall put them in the normal wallets I use when I get my magnetic sheets. So that's the green one stamped out. Now we're going to stamp cut out this blue one quite easy to line up that's the blue one Don't need that. Right, now then. I need... Is it two of these? Yep. And I only got one out. To get four of these little ones. Four of these little tiny leaf dies. And I want that one. There's that and my two small leaves. Right, put them back on their tape so I don't lose them. back in the wallet. This is one set I will definitely use a lot of. Right, get rid of them. Oh. See, I could have lost another one. Right, back to the card. 
the front and our background stamp piece of paper crumb cake this down. Place this over the top and run my hand over it to get an impression. Oh, that's better. And just clean this off. Make the cloth a bit too wet. As I give it a good wash out yesterday. Away, don't need that. And now we are going to put this car together. So let's glue the front on. side in while we're at it. I know what else I forgot to do, I forgot to bring ribbon over. I tell you. Brain dead. Is going to go on dimensionals. Let's make up the ribbon. For this I need dimensionals. place there like that right and these we have two blue a green another green come on another green the navy blue and that and there and then these two leaves under there don't know if I like that blue I think that's too dark Because they're supposed to be the dark ones. 
let's do another leaf but a bit lighter stamp it off even that's what we could do let's see what it's like stamped off yeah I prefer it stamped off yeah it's not as dark Hmm. All this tuna for anything could have it all sorted. Sorry, ladies and gents, if anybody's watching. Don't know if I've got any gents who watch this. Ian, he sometimes watches. Right, take that one off and put that on. Doesn't really make that much difference, does it? Yeah, stick it out a little bit, that's what we'll do. Right, stick these down. This one. So the two light blue ones. And the green one goes a bit higher. And these ones go off to the side. this bit tuck that under This one on there as well. These two, I'm going to join them together and the stem. And then glue them on the back. And stick them out the window out the window. Oh, why stop the dark one? Stop the dark one on and not the lighter one. Okay, I saw that. Want a bit of ribbon? And we're going to tie a bow. Don't want a big bow.
and that will go to sit on top. I'm getting really close to the end on this. Well, not to the end, but close enough to not be able to tuck it in. stick this down is glue believe it or not like that right I've got a piece of blue balmy blue and my sentiment which I'm going to make a bit smaller. Because I don't want a big sentiment on this. Stick it on the balmy blue. going to sit there. So we just need to put a dimensional on it, on that end. So, and a little bit of glue. That and pop that on. Like that. And then we're going to put on some gems. Um, Two there and one there. Like that, this one has got one missing. So we're going to put and then we have it. Hope you like them. If you do, give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of my videos, please subscribe. Uh, if you press the bell icon, You'll be notified of any more videos I upload, which is usually a Monday, Wednesday and Friday. All I can say is thanks for visiting and I hope to see you again soon.